Before we begin this game, there's a little back history on this game because apparently you can't see it when spectating. They should change it, make it a little better. Half this lobby is top 10 right now. The other team does have Hawk, does have Muma. There's also Cyrus and Dove. I think they're on alt accounts as well. So it's a pretty good game. Top 10 people in this lobby. Let's see, let's see how a a, a Doomfist player works. Cool. We did do a spectating Doomfist player in Overwatch 2. That's on the YouTube already, but that's as a tank. Now, we're watching this as a DPS. I feel like the Overwatch 2 beta was so long ago as well. Also, the patience on this man is insane. I would... Okay. Get the kill on the Yana and get out. I like it. It's like the Reaper game that we watched as well on YouTube. The Reaper went in, got a kill, and raced out. Also, I love Overwatch players' names. You have you have Krusty Crack on the Roadhog. Damn, Muma, Muma going in and dying to Krusty Crack. Oh shit! He almost got the Echo. Dude, this man is going X game mode. I can't believe he actually got the, that brig. That brig messed up a big time, bro. I can't believe she has a shield. Oh, he's dead. He's, he got solo ulted. Yeah, there's nothing much he could do. His team should have actually helped him. No, I don't think he's AFK. I think he's just waiting for uh, something to happen. Like, like that. That's he. I. Like, I like watching, I uh, was spectating my friends and whatnot, but like, I hate Doomfist, bro. Doomfist is a stupid character. The fact that you could jump around a corner and punch someone like that and one-shot them, I, it's dumb. But the mobility is fun to watch. He's better now in Overwatch 2. He's different. He's a tank player. He creates space and absorbs damage, and he can still one-shot and do a lot of damage, but... Oh, see, that's insane. See, like, that's crazy, dude. There's no way he gets the brig again, right? Damn. You know what will make Overwatch really fun? But if they come out with surfing, you know Counter-Strike Source or Counter-Strike 1.6 surfing? While you wait for a game, that would be fun. If someone can make that in like a custom lobby. I mean a custom game code. Uh, that was a nice engage even though he missed and got out to live. Oh, uh, they, they, they hit the button to win. There's no way he lives. He did get a pick though. But there's- wait, what? Oh, his- his brig hit the win button. There's no way he lived that. There's a surfing custom game already? Yeah, it's for Lucio and whatnot, but it's not fun. I played the one that was like on Gibraltar. Oh, he, oh, he actually lived. He did have to use his ult to live though, but... Is it gonna be worth? They traded one ult for one ult. That's good. They use that. They use the echo copy. There's no way they get that mercy. I feel like the other team has so many chances to kill RXP, but like they're not taking advantage of it. Like he used his cooldowns twice to go in, and but he like walked out for free. See, like, look, 7 HP, even though he does get shields. And Krusty Crack going at it again, dude. Ball's gonna touch, but... They did pop Primal. He does have his ult, though. And they do have Rally. There's no way they don't hold this, right? Used his ult to clear the mines? Five head strat? That was actually pretty smart. Oh, they have a sim. They're doing the sim TP strat. 
Oh, they're going to high ground with it, not the point though. I want to see what he does here. I want to see how he plays this. Crusty crack going in and getting the first kill though. Oh, he might be able to get a kill here, chat. He's crouch walking so no one hears his footsteps. Oh. I'm actually really surprised he didn't get a kill there. Oh, they see they get another pick. They need to capitalize on this pick. This is this is looking like a lot of our um you know guess my SR and plat games where the, the tanks don't go in. See, look at this, look at this. Two kills. He almost gets the third. He almost gets the third. There's oh he gets the Pharah! Bro, this guy's pairing. This guy's literally carrying the game. This guy's RXP? I mean, he did carry. He did. Hey, listen, I, he let it slide, chat. He did fucking carry that fight. Got the Sigma, got the Pharah, almost got the Winston. Probably did get the Winston. I'm not so sure. Isn't Hawk a top 100? Hawk is, yeah. Top, Hawk is. I think half the lobby. He, he did DM me this code and said half the lobby's top 10, which makes sense because there is. You know, you have, you have an ex-Overwatch League tank player, Muma. You have Hawk, which I'm pretty sure is in the Overwatch League. He gets the ulting Pharah. There's also... Cyrus and Dove on the team. This man literally can't do more for his team. This is the last fight, 10 seconds. They do have Bob going to point. Bob doesn't touch though because, oh my. Bob doesn't touch because Hawk actually came out with the big brain and took the hit before Bob touched point. Literally, no, no, Jeff Kaplan, Jeff. No way, no way. No way. No way, dude. There is literally nothing more RXP could have done. He was playing Overwatch 2 tank Doomfist, and he was playing DPS Doomfist in Overwatch 1. His tanks weren't really going in. It was a crazy game, though. It was him versus Muma, Dove, Cyrus, and Hawk all, and uh, yeah, it was, a, it was a very insane game. That was cool. That was good, though, chat.